Welcome back to Infigyan, my dear friends. Today in this video, we are going to take up one very interesting challenging question from radical equations. The given equation is 11 plus x times 11 minus x equal to square root 121 minus x. We have to find out real solutions. So let's get started by writing domain of the equation first. Right hand side square root is involved. So you will write this should be always positive. If you will find result, then x would come out less than 121. Equality won't hold true. Now come to LHS. So LHS must be positive also. A square root result must be positive. So once you will take number line and you will find out result, you will get to know x should lie in between minus 11 and 11. So take intersection of both the conditions. We can write x must lie inside minus 11 and 11. This is conclusion of domain. Now let us solve the given radical equation. Left hand side you can see it is a plus b times a minus b written. That means we can use difference of two squares formula. So a square minus b square. So I will write 11 square minus x square equal to square root of 121 minus x. So I can write 11 square is 121 minus x square equal to square root of 121 minus x. Now I will give substitution. I will consider 121 equal to t. This is our substitution. So equation will become t minus x square equal to square root t minus x. Now I will take whole squares both sides squaring this equation. So I will get t minus x square whole square equal to t minus x. So I will write t minus x square whole square equal to t minus x. Let's expand and we will convert this equation into quadratic in t. So let me write here a minus b whole square formula. So a square, so t square plus x square, so x power 4 minus 2t x square. Right hand side I will write t minus x. Take all the term to LHS and frame equation quadratic in t. So I will write t square. Then see t term is here and here. If I will consider t common or rather is to say minus t common, then it will become 2x square plus 1. And then after I will write x power 4 plus x equal to 0. Now this is quadratic in t. That where capital A, the coefficient of t square is 1. Capital B is minus 2x square plus 1, the coefficient of x or coefficient of t and constant coefficient is x power 4 plus x. Let's apply quadratic formula t is equal to t was our substitution so equal to 121 equal to minus b so 2x square plus 1 plus minus under the root b square so I will write 2x square plus 1 whole square minus 4ac so minus 4 x power 4 plus x and divided by 2. A is 1 so denominator will be 2. Now let us simplify this side first. 2x square plus 1 plus minus. Expand this whole square. So I will write 2x square whole square. So 4x power 4 plus 1 plus 4x square minus 4x square. 4x power 4 and then minus 4x divided by 2. This division is a complete numerator. Now we can cancel minus 4x square and plus 4x square. Left is 4x square minus 4x plus 1. So it is a square root of 2x minus 1 whole square. See this is the substitution advantage. 
and framing equation quadratic nt. Now you will cancel square root and square term. These two I will cancel immediately. So ultimately what I am going to write 121 which is equal to t equal to 2x square plus 1 plus minus 2x minus 1 and divided by 2. Now let me write in this way. So once I will consider plus sign in between then I will be having 2x square plus 2x minus sign in between then I will have 2x square minus 2x plus 2. Let me write 121 equal to I will write 2x square with plus sign plus 2x over 2 with minus sign in between you will write 2x square minus 2x plus 2 divided by 2. So first you will write x square plus x. Here you will write x square minus x plus 1 and which is equal to 121. Now there will be two quadratic equation. We will find out our result. Let me frame it. So I will write x square plus x minus 121 equal to 0. This is from x square plus x. And second equation if you will frame x square minus x plus 1 equal to 121. So you will write x square minus x minus 120 equal to 0. So two quadratic equations we are having. We have to solve solution for the real x. And remember x should be lying in between minus 11 and 11. This is our restricted domain. So let us consider the very first quadratic equation first. I will use Sridharachar formula minus b minus 1 plus minus under the root b square 1 square is 1 minus 4 ac. So I will write plus 484 divided by 2. So I will consider minus 1 plus minus square root 485 it is divided by 2. So I will write with plus and minus sign separately 485 over 2 and second solution you will write minus 1 minus square root 485 over 2. Now you can see first value square root 485 let me write this value here square root 485 is 22.02 and if you will apply here this first value you will write 10.51 and second value this value is negative minus 11.5 now we have to cross examine with our restricted domain list x should lie in between minus 11 and 11 so we will reject this solution rejected as per not in the domain value so this value we will accept this is true solution now let us consider second quadratic equation. We will solve this. x square minus x minus 120 equal to 0. Let us apply Sridharacha formula. Minus b plus minus under the root b square minus 4ac. So 480 divided by 2a. So 2. So from here we can write 1 plus minus square root 481 divided by 2. Now let us calculate this value if you will see the square root 481 value. Let me write here first. 1 plus square root 481 separately with plus and minus sign. And then we will write with minus sign 1 minus square root 481 over 2. Now question of what is the value of square root 481? That value if you will consider 21.93 approximate value it is. If I will substitute over here or I will put over there first value which I will be having 22.93 over 2 which will be 11.46. And if you will check minus 20.93 over 2 then this value is coming out minus 10.46. Now you can see easily which value you will reject. It is exceeding. So first value you will reject. Second value we will accept. Rejected. 
and this one is accepted value. So here we are having two solutions. Let me write both the values x is equal to minus 1 or let me write here x is equal to minus 1 plus square root 485 over 2 and second value was 1 minus square root 481 divided by 2. You can check both solutions are real and it will verify from the original equation as per the domain. Domain was value should lie in between minus 11 and 11. I hope this video will be somewhere meaningful to you. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe friends. Bye bye till next video. Good luck and take care.